Hey everyone, so here to talk to you about how you can actually eat healthier and save money doing it. Because eating healthy is actually cheaper than eating not healthy, and especially if you're going to fast food or whatever. So I'm going to compare three of my meals uh, to three meals at McDonald's. And McDonald's is one of the cheaper fast food places you can go to out there. So I could have compared to others and made it even more of a difference. But I, I think this should illustrate to you how you can only be healthier while saving more money for the future. So you'll have, you could actually retire earlier. But So I'll give you an example for breakfast. You can get this big guy from Costco this big thing of oatmeal. I forget the exact price, but I estimate that one serving for me, which is a full cup, I mean, I'll eat a huge, you know, a good sized bowl worth. And, uh, you know, that's no more than 25 cents at the most. So that's 25 cents. While the oatmeal's cooking, I'll get some cantaloupe and I'll uh, slice this, you know, slice it up. And I'll have a really good portion of cantaloupe, but it'll come out to about a dollar a serving. And I'll about a dollar twenty-five of strawberries and about a dollar's worth of blueberries. The blueberries will go on top of the oatmeal. And then a 25 cent banana and orange juice. I'll pour a tar tall glass, it'll come out to about 70 cents. Now we'll compare that to a McDonald's uh, breakfast meal. Um, let's say the bacon, egg, and cheese biscuit meal, that's $4.39. Uh, there's also the sausage McMuffin with egg meal, $4.19. If you want a tall orange juice like I have, that's going to you, cost you $2.09. You could also get a medium soft drink, that's $1.29, but we'll go with the tall orange juice, that's $2.09. Bringing uh, the meal to a total of six dollars and forty-eight cents. So again, my my breakfast was four dollars and forty-five cents, with all the large healthy fruit portions, and the meal at McDonald's is six dollars and forty-eight cents. Uh, let's talk about lunch. Let's say you get a Southwest salad with chicken at McDonald's. That's four dollars and seventy-nine cents. You add in a medium soft drink, that's $1.29, that takes it to $6.08. Now I'll have a big spinach salad with fresh spinach. Uh, the spinach will cost about 70 cents. The chopped carrots will be about 20 cents. And then at most a dollar's worth of broccoli. And if you're going to have chicken to compare with the McDonald's salad, you can buy a big rotisserie chicken and have about a dollar's worth of chicken and, to, and a 65 cent juice out of, you know, because I'll have a thing of juice, so a 65 cent worth of juice. So that takes it to about $3.55. So my spinach salad with chicken and juice is $3.55. Uh, to McDonald's meal of six dollars and eight cents. Then for dinner, now I can buy this. This about two dollars. It's a whole wheat spaghetti, which is healthier than the regular spaghetti. Three times the fiber and no enriched flour. I'll get at least four servings out of this. Uh, so that comes out to fifty cents worth of spaghetti. You can buy this really good spaghetti sauce at Costco. This two pack I think is like 10 bucks. So I'm gonna eat about $1.70 of sauce on the uh, um, spaghetti. And uh, to compare to the McDonald's meal, if you wanna throw in a meat source, it'd be chicken, a dollar's worth of rotisserie from the large rotisserie chicken and another 65 cent juice so that comes out to three dollars and eighty five cent for a meal that's probably gonna have more than the Big Mac meal in the Big Mac meal you know you're gonna get a choice of fries or a little salad and a drink 
So when you add up all the meals, my meals came out to $11.85 and the McDonald's meals came out to $18.55. That's a difference of $6.70. Now, you have to eat 365 days a year and that $6.70 different um, that's after tax money so let's say you put that money in your 401k before it's taxed so let's say you're in the 22 percent tax bracket uh, $6.70 before or you know before that money got taxed to take it down to $6.70 you had to earn $8.58 before taxes and then it got taxed and it was six dollars and seventy cents so if you eat your meals at home you can eat healthier and you're gonna uh, be able to put eight dollars and fifty eight cents more into your 401k every day 365 days and that pre-tax money comes out to three thousand one hundred and thirty five dollars a year well, let's say you start doing this from the age of 25 till the age of 60 when you can take out that 401k that's 35 years now you know what that adds up to this is how much more you're gonna if you just ate your meals at home like me instead of McDonald's this is how much more you can put in your 401k in 35 years four hundred and thirty three thousand four hundred eight dollars okay again that's four hundred and thirty three thousand four hundred eight dollars that's why some people who think that's the cheapest option and you know I understand it's you know some people are less fortunate but they don't realize you can actually you know if you eat like you know I just showed you and, and then put the savings into your 401k pre-tax there's 35 years worth of savings just from this simple little move again four hundred thirty three thousand four hundred eight dollars so just want to give you a little illustration on how you can eat healthier and have a healthier financial future and when you are able to cash in that 401k you're gonna be healthier overall so you're gonna be able to go out and do fun things so anyways that's it for now thank you